When looking at this triangle, the first thing we might notice is that it has maybe a right angle. Now, there is no way we can tell for sure because in our definition, it says nothing about a right triangle. So, therefore, we cannot say that it is a right angle. Also, when we look at this, we know it is not an equilateral triangle because equilateral triangle have all equal angles. We know from just looking and what we know in the definition that A, B, and C, all their angles are not the same. So therefore, it cannot be an equilateral triangle. Next, we can look at an isosceles triangle. An isosceles triangle has two equal sides and two equal angles. When we look at this, we know that the vertices A and B are both on the circle, so this line and this line are exactly the same measure. Also, we know that A and B's angles are the same from the circle because it says they are vertices of it and C is lying in the center. So, with all these definitions, we can look and see that the triangle in our circle is an isosceles triangle. Now that we know it's an isosceles triangle, it matches our letter D.